Yo, yo. Um, so we're going to be looking at the work that I did around um, the audio player. One of the most repeated feedback that I've received around the site is it'll be nice to get some sort of feedback or yeah, get some sort of feedback as to like where in an audio you are, like the progress that you've made whilst listening to something. Um, and this is how it looked like before. We just play something and you just get this plain nav, basically. You can skip around like 30 seconds forward, 30 seconds back, or just 30 forward and 10 back, whatever. Um, toggle play pause, ETC. Um, so the first change that I made was just bringing something visual, right? This was the first iteration, basic thing, but the sucky thing is you couldn't interact with it. So this was just um, visual feedback. We still have the same, you know, jump forward, jump backwards thing. Home nav still working the same. Um, and then the second iteration, what I like about this is as soon as you land on the site, I've automatically got my latest mix loaded onto the player. Right, so this is GB49, um, and you can, you know, straight away get into it. You still have the same jumping over ETC. Still mostly just visual feedback, but I also just made this bottom nav like more prominent because another piece of feedback that I received from Svenio is like when he got onto the site, it took him like 15 seconds to realize where like the nav was. So I think he you know, hopped onto a link and was like, oh, fuck, how do I go back? And then, you know, it took a bit of a second to find this. So now it's like when you're here, it's kind of this whole sectioned off thing on the bottom part of the screen. So you should be able to see what's going on, I hope. Um, the color, we've got some shit contrast here. It's still a work in progress. I will try and make it a bit more obvious that there's something going on down here, but also not make it loud. That's kind of what I'm going for on the site in general. And then the next iteration was just tidying this up, just bringing the icons and stuff closer together because this felt a little too spaced out, you know, so I just made that a bit tighter um, and, you know, still the same visual feedback at the bottom. I, I do like the colors, so like, the fact that it's you know on theme with the rest of the site, this little uh, visual feedback thingy. Um, and then now what I've just finished up is I've gone to using like an actual HTML element, which is the input. As of this was just a regular div before, so now we've gone to a range input, meaning that you know you've got the Okay, we're getting too technical. <laughs> so yeah, you can jump around tracks now, basically. And this is the current state of the player, meaning a successful weekend. I've been sitting on this feature for quite a long time because I didn't know where exactly on the UI I wanted to put it and how it was going to affect the nav and all that. So now we've just gone for like the classic music player look. Um, and I'm pretty happy with the results. I expect to be listening to a lot more mixes on here going forward so yeah man thanks for watching like and share subscribe etc law peace